Hey guys, it's Pretzel here. So we are about to start a build of a banana shaped bakery. This is the area that I'm going to build it at and also this is a voiceover right now at the time of making this i actually checked youtube to see if anyone had done one and i didn't find anything however while i was editing this i went to go check one more time to make sure i wasn't missing anyone and when i typed in banana house something came up so i just wanted to give a shout out to this person bell bell place i'm gonna put a link to his or her channel in the description box but yeah, just so you guys can check it out. I hadn't seen the video when I made this. I mean, if I had, it would have been way easier. And I wouldn't have messed up so many times trying to make the shape. And also, for credits to see who helped me do this and who inspired this, it was actually from a bet from a Roblox friend and I. You can skip to the tour if you don't want to see the speed build where I give a lot more information and the decal codes. But yeah, let's get into the speed build.
Okay, hey guys, so it's finally done. So let me kind of explain what happened. Earlier, I started building it by myself. Once I got towards the end of it, lots of friends on Roblox and lots of subscribers, they ended up joining me and helping finish this. So it has way more detail than it would have had had I done it by myself. We were literally cooking and decorating. We had to like delete walls to put the food inside of there, then put the walls back, then put the windows back, then look for the decals. So the only custom decal in this build is this, the Banana Bakery. And it's going to be in my inventory, but sometimes I private my inventory if I'm working on like a secret build. So basically, I'm going to put the codes for these decals in the description box. And then I'm also going to put it like at the end of the video. I made three different kinds of decals with different colors. In case you guys want a different color theme for your bakery, there's a pink background. There's a blue background. And then there's just like a yellow background if you're basic like me. So... All right, so everyone out here, they were just watching Built, and I told them they could be in the tour. Bridget, which is also Brit, she used to be B underscore plays, did a lot of building help. And then on the roof is everyone that helped majorly, so I just told them to like stand on the roof so I could jump up there and get their shout outs and stuff. Obviously, JV takes, we're Roblox friends, we build a lot together, and the original idea for the banana shape actually came from her plot I, I dared her to make a lime so then she made a lime and then she was like okay let's do some more fruit and i'm like okay put it on the same plot and then i asked her if i could try to do the banana for her on her plot it worked out but she said she didn't want to turn it into a bakery she said she's going to turn hers into like a supermarket so i just messaged her and i was like okay i'll just do like a bakery that's shaped like the banana on my plot and I can't tell you any more about what's going on in her plot because I don't want to spoil the surprise. But hopefully once she's finished, we can take a look at it. Like, guys, it is so good. So, okay, I'm going to take pics afterwards. I'm trying to hurry up and do the tour. Okay, now that I kind of explained all that, let's start. This is what it looks like. Shaped like a banana, we have all of the foods and the items that we sell in these, in these glass like in the, sh the area with shelves and it's covered in glass and right here we have a sign that says we deliver because this you're going to be able to like call and place orders and stuff where you can drive the moped so this is for our delivery girl if you're a customer at the bakery you can come and sit out here when you want to eat your food like so and then you can also come inside to order and once you order this is the counter right here after you order, you can either eat inside of here or you can eat outside. Everyone's waiting outside. I just had to do that so you guys can see the interior a little better. Um, Brit is obviously still in here because she did a lot of the help with building and decorating and stuff. Alrighty. Look, this was her idea too, to put this display shelf over here. Here we go. The counters, the fairy lights, and then let's go into the kitchen. So let's see. As you can see, the outside of this build is shaped like a banana. However, we needed like way more space for the kitchen. So what I ended up doing was this. I basically had to, <laughs> this is kind of like a cheat. Okay, look, this, the bakery actually extends into the apartment building, but you can't really tell from the outside. It just looks like a small banana, but there's like a secret passageway that turned this extra room inside of the apartment building into the kitchen so that's that's kind of like a little trick that you guys can use if you plan on making your own and you want more space but yeah this is the kitchen this is where we make all the food we have ice cream machine we have only one stove um i think Britt went and got these yogurts well not these yogurts but these fancy ice creams from the pier over in over right next to the ferris wheel we also have the blenders for the smoothies so yeah it's pretty simple inside of here and this used to be a part of the circus cafe obviously we had to commandeer this room and we also can shut the little door to the kitchen in case our customers um i guess you could say in case our bakers want privacy so yeah that is pretty much it for this and right after this right after my talking right now i'm going to put the codes on the screen so get ready to pause your screen and record the numbers and that is how you can get your own special signs if you plan on making a weird shaped bakery like this thank you 
for watching my channel. Pretzel et so. Pretzel et so. Pretzel et so. Pretzel et so. Pretzel